Welcome to Gemini Blessed TV. Today I'm going to be showing 15 celebrity deaths that shocked South Africa in 2022. Number 1. Ricky Rick Ricky Rick was a South African rapper, singer and producer. He was also the founder and owner of record label Cotton Club Records and a member of Boys and Bugs. South Africa woke up to the shocking news that the South African superstar had taken his own life on 23 February 2022 at the age of 34. He had been battling depression for a while but he couldn't take any more and he left behind his wife and two young children, a daughter and a son. Before he passed away, he sent out his last tweet at 3.20 am on 23 February saying, I will return a stronger man. This land is still my home. Number 2. Jamie Bartlett Jamie was a British-born South African actor, best known for his role as the wicked soapy villain David Gennaro on the ETV show Rhythm City for 13 years. The award-winning actor was also a judge on the reality competition show SS Got Talent. The actor was formerly married to actress Kami Wildman, known for her role on Generations, and the couple had a son, Hector, before they divorced. Jimmy died suddenly on 23 May 2022 at the age of 55. After an autopsy was performed, it was concluded that Jimmy died from cardiac arrest. Number 3. Patrick Shai Patrick Shai was a South African actor and director. He was best known for his roles in the television series and shows Soul City, Generations, Zone 14, Ashes to Ashes, Zero Tolerance, Seven Dylan, and many more. Unfortunately, the legendary actor also suffered from depression. On 22 January 2022, he passed away after taking his own life, leaving behind his wife of 40 years and two children. Number 4. Mkendisi Baldwin Shabangu Unfortunately, Mzanzi did not lose one but two Rhythm City legends in 2022. Mkendisi was a South African actor playwright and theatre director best known for his role as Kulekani on the ETV soapy Rhythm City. His character was the one that had killed and replaced David Gennaro. He was the winner of several awards including the 2004 Standard Bank Young Artist Award. Shabangu passed away at the age of 53 at his home on 24 July 2022 after complaining about having chest pains. Number 5. Mam Pincha Mam Pincha was a South African producer and musician who was a member and the founder of legendary Kwaito group Big Nas. The artist had been married to Babs Odumo since 2020 and they'd been blessed with a son together affectionately known as Sponge. They also had a reality show based on their relationship Utando Lo Dumo which aired on Showmax. Sadly, Mam Pincha passed away on 24 December 2022 at the age of 40 after he suffered a stroke a week before. He had collapsed following a performance with Big Nas. Number 6. Magesh Just like Mam Pincha, Magesh was also a member of a legendary Kwaito music group. Magesh is remembered as being one of the pioneers of Kwaito music during his time as a member of music group TKZ. They rose to prominence in 1997 and a year later they collaborated with Manchester United coach Benny McCarthy on a track which was recorded in Amsterdam and dedicated to the 1998 FIFA World Cup. In 2019, TKZ were the recipients of the Lifetime Achievement Award at the 25th South African Music Awards for their incredible contribution to the local music scene. 
On 15 August, his family released a statement announcing that the Kwaito star had passed away due to an epileptic seizure. Number 7. Pel Shongwe Pel was a South African news anchor, TV host and media personality well known for her role as a news anchor at Metro FM. Her broadcasting career began at YFM in 2010. She would move on to work at the SABC where she worked as a sports presenter. Pao Shongwe passed away in her sleep on Tuesday 8 November 2022 at the young age of 35. Number 8. DJ Dimples Just a few days after the South African hip-hop community had buried Ricky Rick, it experienced another loss after the passing of DJ Dimples. Born in 1992, DJ Dimples was a South African hip-hop DJ and producer who rose to fame working for TV shows at music TV channels such as Vuzu and Channel O. He would later on release multiple albums including hit songs such as Way Up featuring JR and Casper Nuvest and Yaya featuring Dream Team just to name a few. The DJ was also the founder of the popular Pop Bottles Hip Hop event series. Unfortunately, DJ Dimbos passed away on 6 March 2022 at the age of 29 due to a sudden brain hemorrhage which is caused by bleeding of the brain. Number 9. DJ Somebody DJ Somebody was a South African DJ and radio presenter popular voice several hit songs including Ayep Yep, Munati Mpulaya and Liyame Meza. The DJ was shot along with his bodyguard in a drive-by shooting in Johannesburg in the early hours of Sunday morning 20 November and they both didn't make it. Several celebrities paid their condolences to the DJ who was described as a man who was loving, loyal and dedicated to the success and upliftment of those around him. Number 10. Cooley Roberts Cooley Roberts was a South African fashion and beauty tabloid journalist, television presenter, author and actress. She was popularly known for co-hosting the SABC2 reality television show What Not To Wear and as a presenter and commentator on the SABC3 daily talk show Trending SA. She was also a fashion and beauty journalist and editor for the Sunday World newspaper, Fair Lady, Drum Magazine and You Magazine. As an actress, Cooley Roberts appeared on several TV shows such as Musanzi Magic's Inkaba and The Queen. She passed away at the age of 49 on Wednesday 9 February after reportedly suffering from a seizure, leaving behind her two children. Number 11. DJ City Lights DJ City Lights was a South African hip-hop DJ, rapper and record producer from Soweto who was also the brother of late rapper Pro Kid. He rose to fame in 2016 after signing to Ambitious Entertainment and releasing the song Washa featuring MT, Fifi Cooper and Benchmark. The DJ passed away on Valentine's Day in 2022 at the age of 32. He was with his friends when they were shot at by suspects driving a Suva VW Polo. Number 12. Deborah Fraser Deborah Fraser was a multi-award winning South African gospel singer. She started off her career in 1984 working as a backup singer for several top artists such as Lady Smith Black Mambazo, Lucky Dube, Brenda Farsi, Rebecca Malope and Yu Masekela. She would later on release her first studio album, Aba in the year 2000 and following the huge success of the album, she was signed by Universal Music. Weeks before her passing, the singer aged people to include her in their prayers after her health battles left her unable to walk and she was now wheelchair bound. She passed away on 15 May 2022 at the age of 56 after suffering a stroke. 
the gospel singer left behind two children and she was also the mother-in-law of Jerusalem vocalist Noam Trebo, who is married to her son. Number 13, Brian Bruno Majola. Unfortunately, this is the third Rhythm City actor on this list. Bruno was a quieter artist and actor best known for his role as the notorious boy Wongani Kumalo on the ETV soapy Rhythm City. Apart from his role on Rhythm City, Majola has also stayed on Mzan's Magic hit show in Kaba. The act was found dead by his girlfriend on 15 August 2022 at the age of 36. The cause of his death was never disclosed to the public, but some friends who spoke to the news crew said it was suspected that the actor had committed suicide while others believed he was murdered. Number 14, Busisiwe Rai. Busisiwe was a South African-born actress best known for playing the role of Tumiselo on the Netflix drama series How to Ruin Christmas. She was also known for her appearances on several shows including Generations, Sokulu and Partners and City Sessler. She was found dead by her father at her apartment on July 10, 2022. Although the cause of her death was never disclosed, foul play was suspected after bruises were found on her legs. She was 33 years old at the time of her passing. Number 15, Siabonga Zubani. Siabonga was an upcoming actor best known for his role as Dumo in the Mzanzi Magic telenovela Gomora. His first TV role had been on Isibaya where he played the role of Bungezi in 2017. As his career was starting to look up, the actor passed away in May 2022 at the age of 23 after taking his own life. He was described by industry colleagues as a respectful and talented young man who loved art and had a promising future. Thank you for watching. May the souls of all the celebrities continue to rest in eternal peace.